I have a question for Christian pro-lifers. And these are genuine questions. I'm not trying to be catty. These are just concepts that as a Christian woman myself, I have never been able to wrap my head around. Okay, so first, if you were to make God's will law the land, and let's say essentially eliminated most opportunities to sin, what would you say is somebody's test of loyalty to God that would earn them salvation? Why would we want to make salvation easier to obtain? Also, if you are only supposed to be judged by God, then why would we want to make these things a law where if you break them, you go before a judge who is not necessarily going to be Christian. You know, judges are not anointed by some divine being. Also, if our law was set and and based off of a very narrow set of Christian beliefs, then what does that say about the argument for maintaining democracy? Like, what would be the purpose of democracy anymore? How do you feel about separation of church and state? Do you think that government should be heavily involved in governing your salvation? Can you think of any countries past or present that have done that before? And how do you think that's worked out for them? These are just a few questions that I have, but I just want to start there.